What up guys, it's Fire here, uh, with my Let's Play. Nah, I'm just kidding ya. <laughs> As you can see there, it's uh, my old, like, when I first started, the village was all retarded and the pond is only one deep. But yeah, uh, I'm using the new snapshot, uh, since uh, the new release is just next week, uh, the 24th, I decided to do the snapshot. Just to tell you all the th new things that are coming in it, so you can be aware and be ready. Uh, so it's called 1.4, it's the Halloween update, they call it, so it's got cool things in it, can't wait for it. Uh, this one was quite buggy, so excuse if it there's random cuts, um, my bad, <laughs> I just it just all went weird so I had to cut it. But yeah, um, a creeper crashed, or blew up there, yeah. uh, zombies and some spiders, but yeah, anyhow, um, hope you guys enjoy the thing, but yeah, I'll start talking about it soon, now. <laughs> As you can see, this zombie has seeds in his hand. They can pick up random stuff now. And how he's like flinging his arms in the air like an iron golem. That's pretty cool. It's quite new. This spider. I was in some... Oh, I need to kill those. They're annoying me. Okay. I don't know where to start. It's so big. But I'll just kill these first. Oh, if you listen carefully. Spiders. New sound of walking. But yeah, it's like creepy skilling. But yeah, let's start with the animals. That's pretty cool there. Ah, oh, so this is like a fence. It's round. This is a pig. He makes different noises when you hit him. Now, some of them make different noises. You see that cow made a mmm noise. But yeah, anyhow. Um, mushroom, same thing, noise. Chicken. Probably the same noise. A wolf. This is a cool thing, if I don't hit him. There he is. A knife wolf. Let's tame him. And you're like, what's this orange dye there for? So when you tame him now, see how he's got an orange, I mean a red thing? You can change the colour of it. How cool is that? Uh, where's the dye is kept? Yeah, there. So it's just pink. Uh, see, look. How cool is that? You can name him by just the colour. Okay, anyway, that's that. <laughs> um, stairs. And now cornered so if I get some stairs out uh, where is stairs I just run it there we are stairs I think it works as brick as well but they join and then when you go like this they corner that's quite cool uh, works as sandstone I'm pretty sure it works with um, stone stone stairs Yeah, it does too. Okay, but yeah, uh, this is a nether portal. I'll get to that later. <laughs> Nothing different about that. Besides, I'll get to it. Uh -huh. um, that was just to show the spider noise. These are new uh, wooden vents, uh, stone fences. They're as high as a fence. They're pretty good. They're strong. Food textures, they're changed. Uh, so instead of having like a black line around it, it's like nicer looking. I, re I reckon they're nicer looking. I don't know. People hate change in Minecraft sometimes, but I reckon it's nice. I applaud change. But yeah, um, this, you're like, oh, leather, it's changed. It's called leather pe leather pants, boots and that, all changed. But yeah, I'll show you something. So you just grab a die of your choice, throw it anywhere in there, and then bang. Look at that. And this is for something cool later on, I'll show you. Um, so if I just throw this on, oh, you can shift click stuff armor on now, but now if I press F5, oh yeah, green, you can also look like a ninja, that's why that's in there, that will show you later, um, water makes a different sound, I don't know if you can hear that, probably not, okay, sand, there's a bunch of new sounds, these are only some of it, walking up ladders is different, gravel, and souls in all creepy sounds that spider is making that sc scuttling noise okay this is a cool bit uh, a new mob it's a witch uh, they have a pointy hat I'll show you here like that it's pretty cool and if you hit them they throw poisoned and they she ill yeah obviously it's a she goes to heal and when they go to heal themselves their nose goes up and they have like a little wart 
But yeah, she injures herself as well. I wonder if you can have a witch battle. That'd be cool. Uh, but yeah, okay. Skeletons. Uh, they can pick up... Oh, that get spawned with armor. Also, they can pick up your armor. So if I get some armor out... Get some stuff like that. I don't know, I had trouble with throwing it through there. I don't think you can throw stuff through there, so it just bounces off. So let's just open this up. And hopefully they don't die. Please don't die. Oh, he's gonna die. Stupid. Pick it up. Pick up the armor. Okay, they aren't gonna pick it up, but they do pick it up. I was having a nice little sesh with them. Get involved. No. But so when you die, they can pick up your armor. So if it's enchanted, they're going to be quite strong. Uh, this is for another purpose. If I go to. There was some zombies in here. But I don't know what happened to them. They disappeared for some reason. Alright, he's picked up an armor shirt. No. Oh well. Okay. Just spawn some zombies in here. Throw a hat, some pants, some whatever that was. This stuff. Come on, you are letting me down. Pick up the items. Okay, they were picking it up. You know, I feel for those YouTubers now how they like, the thing never happens for them. They should be picking it up. I don't know why. Now I'm picking it up. Is it because it's enchanted? Pretty sure they can pick up enchanted stuff. They pick up random stuff. You saw them pick up. You saw them with seeds. You didn't see them pick them up. Ooh, stay in there. Okay, they aren't liking it. Oh, yep, yeah, there we are. He just picked it up. Enchanted boots. You can see him glow. He's just picked up boots. Ah, oh. see if one will take a hat. Do you want a hat, boy? Look at that. Which? Oh, Alright. Ha! Take it. It's diamond. And it's free. Oh! That one took it. See? How cool is that? I think, yeah, they pick up their own rotten flesh. Like that. See that? Ugh. How weird is that? Now it's working. Get on your zombies. Didn't let me down. I don't know if they pick up bones. So that'd be cool. Just spawn it on him. Oh, I think one of them picked it up. Yep, there it is. Ah, uh, okay. Let's destroy this. Kill them. Kill him. I think it's that one facing the other way. He's got the rotten flesh. Ah, it's that one got the bone. That's cool. Anyhow, same with pig zomb zombies, they do the same thing. Um, there was a ton in there, but they despawned on me. Because I think I got too far. Also, witches do have their own little huts in the uh, swamp biomes, but I can't find it. But they do have these cool little swamp huts. Pretty s cool looking. I'll just throw a bunch of stuff in there and just get them. Where's pig zombie? There we are. Come on, pick up. Pick up the armor. Do it. Come on, do it for me. Do it for all my viewers as well. Come on. There we are. Look at him. Pimped out in iron and diamond. But yeah, that's them. And as you saw over there, there's another mob. Bats. They don't do any damage. They're quite peaceful. And they spawn in caves. And houses. If your house is big enough. And they like to sit like bats do. Upside down. So that's pretty cool. They can't get out because that's one and a half high. So yeah. So yeah. Um, as you can see here. Just move away. Sorry you've gone too fast. But I need to cover everything. There's a lot of things. Uh, these are new beacon blocks. Um, if you get a diamond out, diamond, 
or it doesn't have to be dome, it can be iron bars. These can be anything, they don't have to be mixed either, it's just showing you anything. These beacon blocks have changed so many times in this sna in the snapshots. They're like different beams and stuff like that, but yeah, it's quite trippy when you look inside it. That's pretty cool. Anyhow, so you right click on it and you feed it an item and then you press select what you want. So let's go speed and you press done. So now, as you see my field of death changed and now I should be faster. So if I get to the biggest one, they gradually move up if you see to the left how it has triangle, different pillar, different pillar. See, I think I'm missing out on one again. You can go one more higher. But let's go jump boost. Um, I don't have a diamond on me. Diamond. Or whatever. Uh, so jump boost. So now I should get jump boost. So I should be able to jump a bit higher. I don't know. I can't really tell the difference. There is bubbles emitting from me, but they're really faint. They fixed that up because it got in your way, and you didn't want that in your way for something good. But yeah, that's that. Um, let's quickly get over to here. These are heads. Um, you get them, I think, I don't know the rarity of them, but you get them when you kill the mob. This obviously is when you play multiplayer. You can't get that in single player. I'm pretty sure you can't. So let's just put that them there. This is a new mob again. It's called the Wither Skellington. And you get that from that. But they can be placed in any direction. Like so. Uh, placed on walls like that. It's pretty cool. I think you can even jump on them. Yeah. I go like this yeah okay and the cool thing about it is you can wear it so if I get a zombie boom I look like a zombie Rawr. let's try a creeper I look like a creeper how cool is that that's pretty cool I think anyhow <laughs> uh, command blocks uh, you probably wouldn't care about these most of you guys but those people that like redstone and like building maps these will come in handy so you can just type in things like uh, use at P to target the nearest player so you, if you want to perk the nearest player for being there quick bang they can get that so it can it's activated by redstone so if you have a switch or something it will activate I put random chests around I'm pretty sure yeah okay well, that's the command block. Uh, you can't get the that through here. You have to type it in, give name, and then the number. I don't know, 100 and something, 130 something. But yeah, uh, there's three new potions. I just realised there was three, and I forgot. Um, in the invisibility, which is pretty cool. But yeah, let's start off with enchantments. So there's a new sound for leveling up. So if I hit five ready listen carefully see that little ring so every five it does that ring so if I wait for it like that so that's pretty cool uh, I'll show you the night vision thing when it gets dark which shouldn't be too soon uh, but invisibility now if you look at me I am lost my arms but now, if you take off this, I have no arms and no ch body, chest. Now that's pretty cool, as you can see. Uh, if I had a lighter green, I could look like a creeper, sort of. You could scare your friends, I don't know. Um, but yeah, oh, they probably wouldn't fall for it, it looks a bit weird. You can also throw it on your mobs. Turn invisible. I needed that. Oh, that's new. I didn't know that. Ah, so if you shear it, probably turn invisible. I wonder if that works for the mushroom. Yeah, see the mushrooms on top? Chicken. And, oh, you see the collar still. But they are invisible. Um, let's just get milk to fix up the visibility of me and all the other effects. So I should be free from all that. All good. Okay. 
hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. I just don't want it to be a long video. Um, just upload is terrible, as I always say. Okay, now if I go to survival, uh, you can no longer open doors with left click. With buttons and levers and trap doors, it doesn't work. You have to use right click to open stuff like that. Okay, so right click, no longer left click. I'm pretty sure that's because of survival, um, creative mode, because if you use creative mode, you just destroy it, and you always use right click. And if you know, haven't noticed already here, trapdoors can be put on the lower half and the top half of the block. You can't put it on the same block, but like two. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I think that just updated, yeah. So yeah, that's that. Um, this is the recent snapshot to when I'm doing it now. Um, it involved anvils. So they have a full thing, as you can see there. They fall. That's pretty cool. Um, like sand and that, but they, it destroys the track. Same with torches. Destroys the torches. It squishes them because they have a weight to it. But if I put a torch and get some sand... Do the same for purposes of the video. Drop it down. The sand destroys and turns into the entity. But yeah. Also, if you haven't noticed, there's ear wooden buttons. If you get a bow, you can shoot wooden buttons. If I get it like that, and they stay on until the but uh, the arrow disappears. So as I can show you here, anvils also do damage. So if I shoot that, it kills a chicken. So I'll just show you here with me as the victim or the person going to be squished. I've got full hearts. So if I press this now, bang, it took hearts. So, oops. So the higher I am, oh, the higher the anvil is, the more damage it will do. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I don't know what he's... Oh, he's dying by my dog. <laughs> I was like, what is he dying from? Oh, isn't that sweet? My invisible dog's protecting me. Get him, boy. Okay, but yeah, um, there's three different types of anvils. They do have, so every over time you use it, they do uh, decrease and they get very damaged, as you can see there. So normal anvil, that are uh, slightly damaged and then very. But yeah, okay, so you like, is that all the anvil does? No. If you, I think I just screwed up the next thing. One second, so if I press... Okay, anyhow, um, as you can see there, it has the durability. It tells you how much you've used. So, is people say, oh, is uh, chainmail as good as iron? Well, the answer is yes, it is. See how it has uh, 42, uh, 236 slash 240. And same with the thing, uh, but the first one's smaller because it took more damage. Oh, bigger. It's yeah, smaller because it took more damage. But yeah, uh, but the N1 on the right hand side is the, what it started off with. So pickaxe has got that many uses, 1,561. And gold has got 32, and iron's got 250. But yeah, that's pretty cool thing to know. But with the anvil, uh, you can rename your items and blend enchantments together. So if this if these were damaged, you could fix it. Um, but yeah, this one has got see this one's got sharpness IV and fire aspect two. Now it's going to have fire aspect two and sharpness on the one sword, like so. Uh, you can rename it, but I forgot to do it then. Let's just do it with helm, the helm. Uh, let's just throw the helm there and the helm there. So it's got protection to and protection to and adequate. I don't know what that one is, but yeah. Um, it. I don't think it does it exactly because that should be four, but it puts it to three. But yeah. you can click on here. And you can change it to I don't know whatever you want. Uh, helm. H e l m. Helm. So now you've got your own little name thing. So that's pretty cool. You can name your own equipment. Um, 
I'll just quickly show you if I get a sword, a diamond sword, just a normal diamond sword. Change it to game mode, survival. And just beat up these pigmen. Oh crap! I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> uh, that was interesting. I just got owned by a bunch of pigmen. Okay, I need that sword back. And another sword. Come on. Work for me. Don't blow up. Oh, oh. I'm going to die again. Sorry, doggy. Okay, anyhow, quickly go back. So if I put these two swords together, if, if they were enchanted, yeah, you still keep the enchantment, and they'll be fixed. So that's pretty cool. You can just call this diamond if you wanted to. Then you have just a diamond. But yeah, as you can see, it's getting damaged. The way to craft those are uh, iron, a normal iron. I'm pretty sure if I, I don't know. These crafting recipes, you can find them on the wiki, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but yeah, I'm just, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> uh, these are picture frames. Um, they're pretty cool. Uh, this one has a map in it and it actually shows you where you're facing or just shows you and it'll have other plays on it I'm pretty sure but you can right click on it to change the orientation that's pretty cool that's a, uh, armor just flick it around oh that's a bit glitch did I just I just put another sword in there that's cool I don't know if that's meant to be like that but that'd be cool like that that's sweet I wonder if that works with armor Okay, anyhow. Um, I wish glowstone, or oh, it would be cool if it emitted light, like the torch as well. But yeah. What? Oh, okay, that's just the vine. I thought I was going slow. Uh, bow, just everything. Oh, the clock actually works. Oh, it's night time. One second. Uh, night. Just get this splash potion out. Bang! Sort of like daytime. So that's what the night vision potion does that I was going to show you. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, pot plants. Uh, so you got flower. And you can make them by that. I did that one because I knew that one. <laughs> uh, you can put anything in it. Oh, plant wise, like that. As you can see there. Yeah, that's it. Uh, there's two new plants. You got. Okay, let's just change game mode to survival. Your carrots, potatoes, and you still got your wheat. So there's only two. Uh, so it's pretty good. Uh, the carrots, you use that to breed pigs now. So if I go to creative, uh, get pigs out. Biggie, biggie, pigs. There we are. So you don't use longer use wheat, you use carrots. And there's another cool thing carrots can be used for. But I'll show you after I see. That's one way to breed it. And also breeding XP, as you can see there, just shot out XP. Um I'll just run over here, grab this, and I that's the new item, it's like a carrot on a stick, so it's a fishing rod and a carrot. And they follow it as well. It has a durability, but well, but yeah, put a saddle on, jump on, direct it. You can finally control pigs. How cool is that? Uh, I'm in creative now, but it will go down with a durability bar. Uh, don't yeah, they climb. That's pretty cool, as you can see there. You can finally control it. Go to the left, as I can, as you can see, it's going to the left. So I got my own trusty steed. Can't jump over fences or anything. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, that's that. If I get off it, come on. Uh, what else is there? Should wrap it up soon. Uh, what was I going to show you? That's that. That. Ah, yes. 
with the winter skulls from killing the winter skeletons, if you get them and get some soul sand, you can create this. I don't know why you want to create it. Uh, that's not it. Um, the only reason why you would want to create it, oops, it's going to blow, um, is to create one of those to make a beacon block. So it is a new boss. It will charge up, then blow up, and then, oh, now he's going on a rampage. Uh, I was hoping that would have kept him in there. But okay, um, it kills mobs. I'm pretty sure he kills any mob. I'm not sure. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, so when you kill him, you get one of those. He does regen his health, which is quite scary. But yeah. Uh, last of all, oh, second last, uh, mobs now get transported through portals, like so. So now if I go through the portal, or oh, instant travel as well, bang. There's, there you just go through. This is a terrible never, never pointing out for a bit of lag. Um, I'll just quickly see ooh, more lag uh, in 1.4. Hope you guys like 1.4. I'm quite excited for it. It's pretty crazy. Um, if I missed anything, put it in the uh, descri the comments below. Uh, obviously, I've missed stuff. Uh, the I've just based the main stuff. But yeah, um, that seems about all. I'm just looking around, seeing what I've forgotten. Oh, logs. Sorry. Uh, logs. Uh, act sort of like, well, they don't act like pistons, but they act like pistons when you place them. So if you place them, like, putting at the ground, they'll go that way. If you place them against the block, they'll go like that way. I reckon this is number one. Really cool. Because... Uh, the log placing GUI was pretty crappy, I have to admit. I didn't like it, but yeah, I like this. It's pretty cool. Um, just face it, whatever way, and it goes. So that seems about it. Uh, I Oh, no. There was this one other thing, as you can see under Z, there's an F, and it says west, south, east now. Uh, but yeah. Uh, it changes each time. You'll see it's changed south around about now. Yeah, but yeah. Okay, that was it. Um, hope you guys liked it. Sorry about the glitchiness, uh, the cuts and that. But yeah, uh, leave a comment, subscribe, and for you guys, new guys, I do weekly videos. But yeah, thanks guys. Bye.